policy wanted to highlight the fact that the new technologies are an extraordinary blessing for humanity. They have the potential to enable us as a human race to work together, to be, express our solidarity and concern for one another. And as such, we rightly believe they should be celebrated. At the same time, I think we just wanted to say one thing, is that we need to realise that the technologies themselves are not going to solve all the problems of the world, that there's a need for real human commitment for individuals and institutions to take responsibility to ensure that we realise this potential. And that means that we try and make sure that all our discussions and all our conversations are truly inclusive. So the Holy See would be very concerned about the digital divide, that it would be a tragedy if if mechanisms and technologies that really allow us to grow together were to end up excluding those who are already excluded by poverty. So we would be wholeheartedly trying to support those who are trying to ensure uh, an absolute inclusivity. The other issues I think we would want to raise is that they recognise there's a role for government and for other organisations and regulation in this area. But we constantly want to say it's up to individuals too because a lot of the culture of the internet is established by the individual end users and that they make responsible choices about the type of materials they want to share, produce, um, encourage others to look at. So that there is a role of course for governments but there's also a need to help human individuals to become responsible agents in terms of their own engagement. And the final point we wanted to make was simply was that while the technologies enable the platforms to come into being that will enable us to talk together, to discuss together, to face problems together, maybe we need to recover the human aspect of communications which is particularly tied into the art of dialogue. That is only by listening to others, by willing to learn from them, that we can really make progress as human beings. So that was essentially what we were here to say and we learned a lot listening to others so that was even more important. One thing that I found I took a lot of encouragement was to listen to delegates from different parts of the world um, kind of affirming something that I thought myself is that the development particularly of mobile technology is allowing countries that were traditionally poor in infrastructure to jump right into the digital world. That's reassuring to hear that's not just my own prejudice but that it was confirmed by people from the countries themselves. There was one particular thing yesterday that got me thinking and it's certainly something I'll be bringing back and I'll work with some of our other departments on is the whole thing about accessibility for people with disabilities because if in a sense, it's not about being condescending or wanting to be nice, but if we want to hear their voices and to have the full value of the contributions of people who often have a very, very wise understanding of what our world is about, I think we need to make sure that we make every effort we can to enable them to be fully present so that we will benefit from their perspectives and learn from them.